Hey guys, how's everyone? This is Naman. Welcome to another sneaker unboxing. So I'm really excited about today's sneaker unboxing because I purchased this sneaker after 12 long years. And that sneaker is Converse Chuck 70s Low in this beautiful brown colorway. So as I mentioned, I purchased the silhouette after 12 long years. Now back when I was in school, I used to play table tennis and the original table tennis shoes used to be very expensive. So these were those budgeted options that we had because the sneaker has got a really nice outsole and it provides really good traction when you're playing. Apart from that, back in the day, the sneaker used to fit me really nice. It was comfortable, it was lightweighted and it was budget friendly as well. But yes, because of all those features, I used to wear the silhouette so much that I used to trash them every six months to an year. And I kind of got bored of wearing these so much back in the day that I actually stopped wearing them. And it's been so long that I haven't purchased another pair of Converse. Uh, but when I saw this particular color available, I thought that it's time to finally add the sneaker back into the collection. And I'm so glad that I took that decision. And in today's video, I'm gonna talk about everything in detail, the sizing, the comfort, the fitting, from where you can buy the sneaker in India, the pricing. So make sure to watch the video till the end. I'm talking about this particular silhouette, starting with the color. As you can see, it's a really nice shade of brown. Uh, I initially thought this is more like a taupe kind of a color, but when I saw the box, it is written as squirrel friend which is a very weird name for a color and i've heard it for the very first time but that's the official color written on the box uh, but apart from that i think this is a really nice shade of brown this this is one shade which can be worn during fall and winter heavily but apart from that this is one color which i feel that i can bring during my summer rotation as well apart from the brown color the second color we can see on the sneaker is the famous egret color of converse which we can see on the toe area and on the midsole a little bit over here in the sock liner and for the flat laces as well and the third color being the black color has been used for the lining on the midsole and for the back tab branding as well the same black color has been used for the branding in the insole where they have written chuck taylor converse 70. now a couple of things that i really like about converse is first of all they use minimalistic branding on the sneakers so the branding does not pop out that much and it kind of goes really well with the quiet and subtle aesthetic of the silhouette and the second thing being the outsole, the outsole has got a really nice traction to it. So back in the day when I used to play table tennis, the sneakers used to feel really nice on my feet and I never slipped while playing in the shoes. And of course we know that Converse was the shoe back in 1970s and 80s when it comes to sports. And I really like the fact that they have still added sports shoes back on the tongue area wherein they have written Chuck Taylor, player's name and athletic shoes. So I really like the fact that they have given this very small detail in the shoe to kind of remember that Converse were the athletic shoes of that era. And now quickly talking about the sizing here, so I went for UK 10. Now my true to size is UK 9 when it comes to Nike or Jordans and it is 9.5 when it comes to New Balance and Adidas. But uh, unfortunately, UK 9 in Converse fits me a bit snug and we do not have 0.5 sizes in Converse. So I had to go for UK 10. It is a bit loose, I have, have a little bit of space in the toe area, but I honestly do not mind it that much. And specifically during winters, I any which was go for thick socks. So I think that's going to cover that. Now quickly talking about the comfort of the sneaker. So the majority of the comfort in the sneaker comes from the insole. Apart from the insoles, the sock liner or the tongue does not have any padding to it. So to compensate for that, Converse has used really nice insoles and they're very well padded and feels really good on feet. Now talking about one thing that I do not like about Converse, it is not in the sneakers, but it is the box of the shoe. So I feel that this box is quite small and when you receive the sneakers, they kind of in a very snug kind of a way and uh, they, they're kind of out of shape. The, the canvas material is kind of pushed and pressed and I really do not like my sneakers in that sort of a condition. So I have decided not to use the box. I'm going to keep the sneakers out just like that. And uh, the box is probably going to be used for something else. But this is the only thing that I do not like about Converse is that they're still using these small boxes. I think they should increase the size of the box just a little more so that the sneakers can fit in well. Um, but apart from that, I like everything else about the shoe. 
Their sneakers look really good on feet. They're quite comfortable. And the best thing is that they are very budget friendly. Uh, the normal retail price for the sneakers in India is 5,500 rupees. I bought these from Mintra and uh, I think I got a decent discount. I ended up getting these for around 4,100 rupees, which I think is a really good price for this particular silhouette. And though lately I've not been going to office, I've been working from home, uh, but I feel that Converse Chucks are the best daily wear sneakers under 5,000 rupees. And the good thing is that now we have an official website of Converse in India from where you can purchase low tops, high tops. There are a lot of new different models of Converse as well. I'll put the link for that down in the description. Apart from that, Mintra also has got a decent collection of Converse available on their website. You can check that out as well. I'll find a few links and I'll leave those links on the description for you guys to check it out. Um, but I feel that if you are on a budget and if you're looking for a daily wear sneaker, Converse Chucks are the best sneaker you can find in the market right now. And yes, that's it for today's video guys. Just wanted to make a quick review video about the sneakers. And as I mentioned, I'm really happy and excited to add these sneakers back into my collection. And I would request urge you guys as well that if you do not have a pair of converse in your collection yet i think it's time that you look for a nice color and add it in your collection and that's it for today's video if you like the video do hit the thumbs up button down there do let me know in the comment section what you think about the sneakers and if you guys are new here do subscribe to the channel and i will see you guys in the next video